Hi there, my name is Marisa, or you can call me Mar. Um, today I'm going to try for the first time to carve a bear out of a small log. Um, so we'll see how that works. Um, I've, I'm using, gonna try to use, I'm familiar with this one, I've used this one a few handful of times, just logging in general. Uh, this one right here is a little bit bigger than I'm used to, and um, I literally just tried it for the first time like five minutes ago. So I hope this goes well and um, hopefully we'll have a bear at the end of this video. Okay, so that first saw was really heavy, and uh, I don't have a lot of upper body strength. Um, but the second saw is a little bit easier, but I think it's out of gas. <laughs> okay, so I just learned a few things. I, its fuel was not gone, um, which I thought was weird because we just filled it. But um, I actually just accidentally bumped the safety bar, which is nice because it works. Um, and I also learned that part of the reason why I was having a hard time is because the big saw is for cross-cutting and um, the little saw is for ripping so now I know what that is cross-cutting is just usually what we do is we cut the logs in half and ripping is going um, like through the grain or vice versa anyway back to art and creating little bears out of wood Okay, so yesterday I got pretty tired, so I'm going to pick up where I left off. I put the um, bear on a piece of, like I lifted it up on a bench and hopefully that will help because it was kind of a pain in the butt to just uh, stoop over to try to um, work the chains off. So we'll see how today goes. Out of gas.
Okay, so I think I'm pretty much done with the bear. Um, it's been quite a learning experience because it's a lot harder than I thought and my arms are a lot wussier than I thought. <laughs> I had to take quite a few breaks because that chainsaw is exhausting on the forearms. So I thought I would show you the bear. So here he is, or she. <laughs> Haven't decided yet. So I think for my first attempt at a bear, it's not too shabby. I definitely learned a lot though. Um, here, I'll sit right here next to him. Okay, so I definitely learned a lot because as you can see right here, he has a split. And it, um, so I thought I chose a good piece of dry wood, but apparently, um, not quite. Um, it looks like the bottom had rotted just a little bit. And so he, okay, I keep saying he, so obviously it's a he now. So, um, you can see his paws. There's a split there, so I had to be pretty careful because I didn't want his paws to fall off. And then, um, there's, it continued up here. And I had to be careful because it was right here too. So, um, yeah, there he is. Not too shabby. I think I might've found a new hobby. Uh-oh.